Welcome English Cartoon Story. Episode 2 Yes, see, it has blue color in it too. That would look good too. Yes, but I already have that color. It's looking good, but Anna, you know, we don't have much money. We'll check. Here, take the money. And pack this and this. Hanny, what's wrong? Both her sisters are getting married. Don't you know how picky she is? Both her sisters are getting married. It's not a problem. You end up getting what you want. Hurry up. We have to get other things as well. Um? See, I was thinking to wear this for the function. What do you think? Bring it in the front. In the light. See. This is a very dull color. Get a color suitable to your age. Red, blue, yellow. This. To be honest I'd never wear it. It doesn't look good. I never liked the pink color. Get the children something to eat first. Yes, Dad. I'll get something right now. Come on, everybody. I don't understand the generation today. They open their eyes later and first they are given tablet and mobiles. What should I do, Dad? Until I give him the phone, he doesn't eat. Come, dear. A little bit. These are just excuses to give them the phone. You give them the phone and be done with your responsibility. That's it. Here, Dad. Thank you, my son. Hello. When did you come? I just came. He just left for office after dropping me and... Secondly, I'll stay here until your wedding. This is amazing news. Of course. We only have about ten days and a hundred things to be done. How will I do it all alone? It's good she's here. Now that I'm here... I'll get everything done. All praise to the Lord. Dad, before I forget, I had to give you this check. You have to make a lot of payments to the vendors, decorators, caterers. It's for all that. Yes. This is a good thing you did, son. Now you'll see the reception I'll hold for you. Dad, just be careful about one thing. I'll have a lot of acquaintances at the reception. Don't leave anything below average. Aaron, you'll see. The wedding will be remembered by the city. People will give examples of the reception Abraham held for his son. If God wills. Let me know if there's anything to be done. Um. Oh God. Arranging two weddings is a very difficult job. Mom, didn't you pray for both of your daughters to be married this year only? Really? You little one. You know how to remind mom of what she said. All praise to the Lord. All three of my nightingales are singing together. Sirsik, you leave your father's house barren. White skin, I'll miss this laughter. Dad, you don't have to be upset. I'm your daughter first and then everything else. As it is, I'll not go anywhere from your life or heart, but I don't know about her. Be quiet. Dad, I'm not going anywhere. As it is, Dad. Your little nightingale will be here with you. Why be sad then? You're not a nightingale but a loudspeaker. Dad, look at her. You three are the stars of my eyes. My princesses. I live for all three of you. When will you take an off? 
Sister, more than half of the office depends upon me. I cannot be at home for long. Brother, what if you're in the office at the day of your wedding? What will Hani do then? I'm applying for leaves tomorrow. Don't you worry, dear. Listen, son. Amy called. They have two weddings and they want to buy clothes and stuff for you and get it done with. Mom, didn't you tell them not to get anything for me? I have my own taste and choice. I don't wear what others give me. Dear, this is wrong. The bride's family also has dreams. I cannot straight away say no. Mom, you know that, but I'll not use them at all. Tell me where is Nassim? I don't see him. Where would he be? He'll be wandering around with his useless friends. It's all your mother's pampering. If we say anything, she rushes to defend him. Dad, I disagree. It's all your leniency. In his age, we were working a full-time job. And he's roaming around with his friends. Said no to everything, but I don't feel good about sending away Hanny without anything. I was thinking I'll transfer 500,000 rupees in account and give him 200,000 as a wedding gift. Am I right? You're absolutely wrong. You're not doing anything. You've already given me everything I needed in life. You fulfilled all my wishes and gave me such good education. L don't want anything else from you other than prayers. My princess, my sensitive daughter. There are some societal rituals. See, I'm giving one of my daughters so much and I don't like sending off the other one empty-handed. What will the world say? No matter what the world says, I don't like all this and I'm happy that Adil doesn't too. He already said no to taking anything, please don't do it. Dad, the money you're saving because of Hanny? Do one thing, get me something from that too. Yes, get her whatever, I won't mind. I don't want to see him with those loafers. Tomorrow, he'll help me with all the wedding chores. I'm an old man and I'm rushing everywhere. I'm looking after the decorations. I'm looking after the catering and banquet hall and he has no sense. Dad, don't be angry. Your blood pressure will shoot. What blood pressure will shoot? You leave it. I've always been saying. Please stop it. Leave everything. Don't be angry. And you. You'll do everything sensibly and nothing wrong. And you'll help dad. Understand? Go to your room. You've destroyed our peace. There's nothing peaceful with him around. Is dad done lecturing or still going strong? Nassim, everybody was so worried all night. What did you get worrying everybody like this?